happy, 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 happy Wednesday. That's right, it's Wednesday. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the meme we're about to go down and experience together. If you like what you see, please subscribe, hit like, and let's go see some memes. Ten minutes into the family walk, and this is a spitting image of how she's going. Pretty close, definitely pretty close. Uh, I would say we're at a point of maybe a half hour. Maybe it adds like five minutes every single year they're born. So it's like, ah, the age of six, you get about 30 minutes. Age of two, dude, 10 minutes is a long time. 50-year-old plane in my head. (laughs) 50-year-old plane in reality. Tell me they never upgrade those suckers, but yet they tell us what we see. We're about 20 years advanced in the technology that hasn't been released yet. Um, So they say, whoever they is, but here you go. Here's the proof. When you accidentally click the left stick and go into stealth mode, <laughs> just as the cutscene starts, uh, dude, the panic buttons, man, I call it the scroll of death. If you play on keyboard and mouse, get into a battle, a heat of battle, you freaking spin the wheel, just hoping that uh, it lands on the right thing and you click and win. Aaron Burr killing Alexander Hamilton in a duel in 1804. Alexander Hamilton Jr. representing Burr's second wife in their divorce in 1836. Hmm... A bit of fun fact, too, is that uh, Aaron Burr, he shot twice. You're not supposed to shoot twice in a duel. One of my blinds broke in my bedroom, so I just went to CVS. Dude, look at that. It actually really blends in. It takes a minute, almost like uh, you go to Menards and they slap that freaking whatever, their little warranty label on there. Those stickers are tough to get off. Almost looks like a giant one of those. (laughs) What? This is, uh, I don't know how, why a plumber would do this, but... Way, the, way to put the clock in the right spot. Maybe that's what it was used for. I don't know, but uh, picture perfect. Another architecture fail. Where's the window? Well, there is none. We put it in for the aesthetics to make you feel like uh, there's a window. Because who even has the blinds open in a hotel anyway? Honestly, probably not a lot of people. Maybe in the morning when you're leaving, but that's it. I didn't say I was thirsty. And then you get this. You know, it's an easy fix. I think maybe... Wow. Dude, no way. What architect looked at this and, uh, dude, what, like, what? Did, was there an earthquake? Half the building sunk and this is a solution to fix it? <laughs> dude, you got the handicap door with stairs on it? Come on, man. We're, this is definitely not in the U.S. of A. I know building codes and this would never fly, dude. That is a uh, American dream in a nutshell. Someone's suing this business, this place. Papa Squat, I tried, and uh, I couldn't get there, you know? We had one of these at a place I worked at. I was like, really? Really? Why do we have it up there? We spent money on that crap? Come on, dude. Can't we just get, like, a cardboard box, paint it nice, put it up there? If we're really looking to make things look nice, you know? We don't need to buy real stuff. What kids will never know. Tightened by God himself. Barely hanging on. I don't even know if they have these cords anymore. When you buy a monitor, I think you straight up just get an HDMI or you get like the hybrid HDMI with a square end. But back in the day, dude, you only need to tighten one. And sometimes, dude, I didn't even tighten them. It's in there. When you've been sitting at the loading screen for 15 minutes and realize it says, press any button to continue. (laughs) Or when you're in a lobby with your buddies and you're the leader, sitting there talking, BSing the whole time and going, oh, dude, sorry. I didn't realize everyone was waiting on me. But nobody says anything either, so 10 minutes go by. You can't really say it's your fault, can you? Me, before and after being home with the kids before nine days on spring break. It gets to be long. It does, but uh, that's the bonding time. And the worst part in Minnesota with spring break is it's not nice out. It's not like you're going outside to do anything. So it's like, uh, then you're stuck inside all day. What an absolute oof. Builds first indoor toilet reaction from the people when they learn that you she indoors. <laughs> I can't imagine, dude. Back in the day, you've this is probably the looks you get. Wait, so the poop is just going to be inside? Like, it's inside with you? That's disgusting. When you catch a spider in a cup and throw it outside, go now and die. <laughs> in what way seems best to you? Dude, I... Spiders, whatever, dude. Just, it's a flick. The thing is dead. You squash it. You freaking put your thumb on it. Done, done. Or if it's a big one, get the shoe out, man. 
me eating out for the fifth time this week because I care about small businesses. <laughs> it supports, it grows the economy, doesn't it? It builds the economy. Whatever, if it makes you sleep better at night, do it, as long as you're paying your bills too. <laughs> me enjoying every minute of motherhood. Maybe not motherhood I know experience, but fatherhood. Um, waking up at 2, 3 a.m., maybe 11. It, we got pretty lucky. Our kids kind of slept through the night right away. But um, you get a colicky baby, dude. That is a fear, an unwritten fear that I think many parents experience. We got to reach out to the youth. Car wrecks are out of hand. Me, on a boss. Hey, teen, buckling up is totes yeet yo. Oh, is it? Cringe, man. Cringe. Cringe it up. Hear me out. This meal will always be elite. This meal... Actually, dude, this is a really good meal. The only thing I don't think they did is uh, toast the bun. You got to toast the bun. It makes it 10 times better. But away from that, dude, you don't need hot dog buns. You don't need uh, hamburger buns. Just a little bit of bunnage, man. How I hope my character might look through the game. How my character actually looked through the game. The reason why is because the stuff on the left is free... The stuff on the right, they come out with once a month and they make you pay for it. And people buy it because that little shirt, those goofy looking pants, they give you plus 10 stanima. <laughs> this image just popped in my head from the deepest part of my memory. Dude, I remember this game so much, man. Uh, I don't even know if it's still playable. That's pretty sick. But did anybody reach the bottom? I can't remember ever reaching the bottom, but that's sick, dude. Imagine getting cut off by the SpongeBob mobile get cut off by this you know even away from that i want to see someone resell this list this on marketplace and please tell me what someone is willing to pay for it because there's only like 10 people in the world that would buy that dang thing and i ain't one of them when you just told the kids they couldn't have a snack then your husband caves you mother trucker but this is what this is a problem is they ask mom and you don't hear the response because it's can we have a snack no you probably didn't hear that because that's how loud it is and then they come up to us. It's like, wow, they're being good all day. Like, you ate your food? You want a snack? Yeah, dude, go just go pick it out yourself. The joke I just told. Making my friends laugh. Making myself laugh, though. It does happen, and it's the best. When you can make yourself laugh, that means you can hang out with yourself at all times. You don't need to be in a group of people. You don't need a bunch of friends. You just need you, yourself, and I. <laughs> when your kid says, Mom, for the 745th time, Bruh. And dude, sometimes it's the worst because you're like, just wait, we're having a conversation. Dad, dad, mom, 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 mom. And you're like, dude, just wait a minute. Kids today, mom, can I have my iPod back? Me as a kid, the minds are calling <laughs> and I must dig. That's a nice one too, man. That is a real genuine, like, if you could put a brand on this, this is like a cat. This is like a big top tier type uh, digger at the park. Candy Crush developers, moms at level 9,718. <laughs> we're done when I say we're done. <laughs> just repeat the levels, man. It's rinse and repeat. It's all the same thing anyway. Who gives a crap? You just got to come up with a clever one like every 10 levels. So it gives you that extra hard and makes them stuck on it for a day or two. But away from that, man, whatever, dude. How my daughter sleeps knowing she was a terror all day. Like a, just like a baby, just sleeping like a little baby. Because they do. Memories is tr done, gone, whatever. You were crying, throwing a tantrum 30 seconds ago. Now you saw a shiny piece of candy. Done, it's over. There you go. In my head for some reason. 1899, Napoleon Bonaparte. 1901, <laughs> a train conductor. Well, you know, different times, man. Different times. Maybe two years, but that's a different generation right there. How my kid smiles for a $200 package of school photos. Never the best. Never the best. And then they get later in school and they absolutely don't take it serious at all. If anything, sometimes they switch each other's photo. And then it's like, wait, what, dude? A child's opinion. Disrespect. Corporate needs you to find the difference between these, this picture and this picture. Every parent. They're the same picture. Pretty much, pretty much. The disappointment in a child of the word no. You get both of them back real quick. Split second, done. There you go. You have the disrespect and the opinion in one. Done. <laughs> this is a type of vandalism I can get behind. Lasagne is nasty. 
Oh, lasagna is tasty. So if I read it right, it does sound better and it does taste better. I was going to say, dude, lasagna ain't that bad. Lasagna, don't touch it. Not good. Nintendo trying to create a final boss character for Super Mario Bros. Super Smash Bros. Hand. I got hand. Uh, when you were a kid, dude, at least back in my day, that was oh, so amazing. When you stayed at a buddy's house, you guys grinded Super Smash all night just to beat the hand. And when you beat the hand, I think it was on hard, you got you unlocked a special character. My kid getting in trouble for drawing on the walls. Do I regret it? Yes. Would I do it again? Probably. And they will do it again. Why? Because it just is what it is. The, the no doesn't retain. But uh, as long as they don't color on the TV, dude, I've seen that a couple times. And it's like, what? You're trying to fill in the colors, man? It changes like every two, three seconds, maybe five on a good scene. You're not filling in that white shirt, dude. That one unemployed friend at 2 p.m. on a Tuesday. I know. And then you're like, dude, how do you get money? Like, how do you pay for stuff? Well, they do, uh, I don't know. They do all sorts of things. And they leech off. They float from friend to friend. That's how it works. Parents in the 80s. Don't watch that movie. It's too scary. Also, parents in the 80s. (laughs) Let's go to dinner. And that's a good idea. Jeez, dude. I... Hitting the cycle again. Five Nights at Freddy's, here you go. Never, I don't think we ever did Chuck E. Cheese, really. I don't know if this is Chuck E. Cheese or Chuck E. Sneeze. Parents all went along. Zero days since our last illness. Cycles. And then when you get a family in there, it hits one, and then you know, the countdown begins before you get sick. Start taking medicine now. It might help you. Probably won't, but it might. And then two weeks later, when it's all done, you think you're in the clear, boom, dude, it strikes. When you replay the first game you ever played and it still brings you the joy it brought so long ago. Thank you, old friend. Two games for me. Pokemon. Game Boy. (laughs) Gotta rip it. Go hard at it. And then uh, a week later, World of Warcraft, dude. You always gotta do a new character in World of Warcraft. (laughs) Resting Birch Face. (laughs) Uh, This tree got cut down. Sold on eBay for... $5 $5 million. I love when you see one of those. And it's got to be a, a rich guy playing on himself. He listed it. He bought it. And he was willing to pay the hundred grand or whatever. Whatever it was, the eBay fee, just so he'd get a news article. The dream setup. Dude, this is the dream setup for sure. Late 90s, 2000s here. This is like walking to someone's house and they got this. Oh my, dude. You know, backyard baseball is about to be lit AF, dude. Spring break in your 20s versus in your 40s. Uh, Yeah, in your 20s, it's a little different, though. Your responsibility level is at a near zero. You're probably still, you know, you're working, but got a lot of roommates, whatever, living with buddies. In your 40s, man, it's like, ah, this is all my stuff. This is my area. This is my hermit town. Spring break. Students, no school. Parents, (laughs) what will I do with these kids? What will you do with them, huh? Well, if you're in the North, nothing. You're going to sit at home, do nothing. Uh, Now they don't even give you a long enough break to go down South. That's how everyone used to do it. You have spring break and you leave South. Now they only get like two days, three days. It's like, what? It's ridiculous, dude. (laughs) This guy didn't win an Oscar until he was 70 years old and had starred in 37 movies. Never stop following your dreams. Oh, man. You tell me these people are never scared of nothing? Running around yelling, Gayaka, Gayaka. If you can name that movie, I love you. Signs of a PC gamer. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. You can tell this is like a Dell keyboard, too. Like, just not one that should be used for gaming. Just your traditional at-home, casual user. It's not making the clicky and the clackies. It worked, didn't it, dude? It got you all the way through... Uh, this This keyboard got you through Westfall. Got you into the freaking... Dark Forest, Scarlet Monastery, dude, Stranglethorn. You got there You got there on this keyboard. I have a newfound respect for YouTubers. <laughs> this is actually takes so long. It does take a long time. And love Minecraft. It's a different game. Like, I will say, you will play it. You'll look at it and won't play it. Say it's the dumbest thing you've ever seen in your life. Then you go play the thing and you're like, wow, dude, actually this game is pretty badass. This is how it feels when you send me your social security number and credit card info, by the way. (laughs) Uh, Yeah, if you guys want to, here you go. Tip of the day. You want uh, $40,000 in just a couple hours of, of work passive income? Put that below. 
Uh, don't do that, by the way. Someone, I won't take it. Somebody else will take it. When you time travel to see cool dinosaurs, but forgot to account for Pangea. Yeah, I guess maybe when you time travel, get a boat. Uh, make sure the thing can fly. Then you'll be all right. But what if there was no Pangea? What if it was just all a big ball of water? I turned around and for a brief second thought my cat was flying away when I was gardening. <laughs> now, it very much looks like that. I got to say, this is pretty freaking... Uh, you look at it for a quick second, it does kind of look like it. But what's underneath there? What's the cat hiding? That's what we got to know. Today's kids would never be able to handle this pain. Actually, I don't think they could. Dude, something doesn't load for uh, five seconds, they freak out. There's a commercial, a commercial on the TV. Freaking lose their mind. This happens? Oh my, dude, good luck. Emulators, really? Man of your PC specs? It's a peaceful laugh. Because <laughs> you learn that, dude, those are the games that you want to play. The, the Dude, the new games they sell you on are BS. I'm so sick of these new games. And the only thing they changed was the special ability of the character. It's like, oh yeah, we've done this before. We've played this before dumb and you made me pay 70 bucks bull crap watching your kid pick up 45 easter eggs in less than a minute when it takes hours for them to clean their room <laughs> now you know it's because they don't want it you, you watch them and they kick and scream as soon as you go down on a knee and help it takes 10 minutes it literally if you went to taking the bucket of legos and tipped it upside down it would have been done by now why are you <laughs> why are you so serious about this it's just a game <laughs> the game well, you get sacrificed at the end of it, but hey, just out of just because you're going to be remembered forever. Does anybody remember any of these players? No. So they lied to you. Worst that can happen to a gamer. Ah, <laughs> uh, dude, he's got the freaking Starbucks. This guy went out, was getting ready for a Saturday off hard game sesh. And this happened. I would, I'd cry a little bit, man. That'd be a very sad, sad freaking morning, man. But that's why, dude. Nothing at the computer station. Don't do it. I would not survive a jigsaw trap because he would have to repeat the instructions several times. Or uh, the, my favorite one of the jigsaw ones is like, dude, I'm, a, I'm away from work, man. How long can we make this last? And I, you know what? If you, I'm done, I'm done, I guess. You know, no more work. That one is hilarious. This one, eh, you only get one shot. It's a freaking VCR. I don't think it just keeps going back and forth. But all right all right that does it that does it for this meme image did you guys enjoy all right did you because i hope you did because you know what we only have a couple of these left they'll keep coming out we'll keep doing memes i actually enjoy the memes but coming to you mark your calendars it might be saturday i'm kind of waiting to see what happens but for sure on monday we are getting a walmart a real walmart vid back at it and it's gonna it's gonna knock your guys' socks off be prepared and enjoy and I hope you enjoyed this one, and I hope you keep coming back for more, because you never know what's going to be next here on the Steve Channel. Uh, me. I'm not going to yell as much this year. Me. Seven hours later. Good show. This is a show you never hear of anymore. Uh, Xena the, the Warrior. It's like Conan the Barbarian, meet this gal. I think it was a spinoff of Conan, if I'm not mistaken, but... Just don't see it anymore. It's gone, dude. Left in the 90s.